I got to tell you guys, I went to the Black Music Honors um, Awards show last week. I had to come out of here last weekend, y'all remember? Mm -hmm. And, and um, uh, on Thursday and Friday, it was absolutely amazing. And I want to wait till our sisters get back, our other sisters, Rashawn and Quad, get back to kind of go through the whole thing. But I will say um, there were some uh, beautiful things spoken about the late... Mm -hmm. um, Aretha Franklin mm -hmm. and her okay. passing and Sister Circle was down to the carpet and we were able to talk to um, some amazing people that said some amazing things. So let's take a look. We lost an American icon today. Not black, just black America. Everybody loved Aretha Franklin, no matter what race, what nationality, what uh, political party, everybody loved Aretha Franklin. She's created an era of what we call music. You know, if you look at it from the time she started making music to now, it's like it's never been a world without her. She was anointed, and I just, you know, it's bittersweet. She made her own rules because she was confident in her gift. She was great, you know, and greatness only comes in one form, and she was the greatest. Miss Aretha Franklin, you know, anybody who can combine rock and pop and opera and gospel and soul and rhythm and all of that stuff in a time where everybody wanted to be segregated. She started it. We have a real, real strong responsibility to continue that thing. It's a sad day because the queen has passed away, but I'm honored. I'm thankful. It's sad, but we celebrate um, Aretha for the door she opened up for all of us. Miss Franklin was able to be who she was, and she was authentic wherever she was. And so whether she was at the White House, she was going to cut a step, she was going to give God praise. Wherever she was, she represented God. She's the one that got into those rooms, represented uh, an aspect to our greatness just as a race. She represented freedom for us to be able to fight to do what we do. Uh, I'm also a civil rights activist and a civil rights baby and I just followed in her footsteps. Not only was she a voice for us or a face for us, but it was so many other morals uh, or moral like messages that were in her songs. My God, wow. she will be missed. Yes. I know for me, for certain, mm -hmm. she will be missed. She is part of my soundtrack. So. Yes, super fan over here. Yeah. Um, when I graduated from the University of Illinois from undergrad, we have a black congratulatory, mm -hmm. and we march in to her rendition of Young, Gifted, and Black. Oh, come on It's now. powerful. Yes. And so, yeah, that's what I thought about. And, um, and of course, we love Ain't No Way. Right, you know? right. So, yeah, right, she's yeah. just, I mean, across the board, amazing. Mm -hmm. and